All right, here are 11 ways your dog says, I love you. Did you know that dogs basically have the same brain structures for producing emotions that we have? Thanks to this little similarity, there are several ways your dog can express their infinite love and appreciation to you. But before you find out what they are, don't forget to click the subscribe button and ring the notification bell to join us on the Bright Side of Life. Alright, number 1. Gazing into your eyes Japanese scientists from the Department of Animal Science and Biotechnology at Azabo University, along with specialists from other Japanese universities, conducted a study that showed how dogs develop strong emotional connections with humans by staring into their eye. This silent contact increases the level of the social hormone oxytocin in both dogs and humans. Scientists also believe that this human-like mode of communication may have been acquired by dogs during the domestication process, tightening their bond with their future owners. Number 2. Bringing you their toys All dog lovers know how possessive their friend can get about their toys and other chews. So, if your dog proudly runs toward you with their favorite toy or even pushes it forward a bit to encourage you to take it, you can be sure that your pet's love for you is strong and unconditional. This comes from a dog's close connection to its pack. In each pack, the leader – for your dog, it's obviously you – eats first. Other experts see this as a declaration of endless trust. Either way, it's one of the biggest expressions of a dog's love out there. Number 3. Yawning when you yawn Humans yawn contagiously, and this process is closely connected to our empathy. And, as it turns out, a dog's nature here is almost the same. According to a study conducted by Teresa Romero and her colleagues at the University of Tokyo, Simultaneous yawning is another sign that your pet is emotionally bonded to you. So, while scientists are still trying to explain this fun phenomenon, you can do a simple test yourself to check if your dog truly loves you <sighs> Yawn, <sighs> and see what happens. Number 4. Sleeping with you now, dogs are known to be pack animals, and even though some of their past pack habits are long gone, they still like to take advantage of their buddy's body heat. But what's especially important is that dogs are pretty vulnerable when they sleep. Therefore, if they choose to snooze next to you, this means that they trust you like no one else. So don't be afraid to let your pet sleep next to you, because scientists totally approve. According to a 2017 study published in Mayo Clinic Proceedings, sleeping with your dog can actually improve your sleep efficiency, since having your pet nearby helps you relax more. Number 5. Wagging their tail We usually connect tail wagging with friendliness, but specialists insist that it can portray a whole range of emotions. Dr. Carlos Acusa of the University of Pennsylvania School of Veterinary Medicine says that tail wagging is a special language that dogs use to speak to us. In general, it's a sign that your dog is open for interaction and emotionally engaged in everything that's going on around them. However, it also depends on the height and speed of the wag. A wagging tail held high is a sign of enthusiasm and confidence. A lower tail indicates nervousness. A stiff or slow wag, on the other hand, is a red flag, revealing that your dog is tense and not in the mood to be friendly. Number 6. Raising their eyebrows and showing their tongue A study published in Scientific Reports Journal in 2017 showed that dogs produce way more facial movements when humans are looking at them. They can raise their eyebrows to make their eyes look bigger, show their tongue, or even use their secret weapon that no one can resist. 
puppy dog eyes. Well, that's how I got hooked. And just so you understand the true power of a dog's love, even the presence of food had no impact whatsoever on their expressions. By the way, another study that was published in the journal Science confirmed that your furry friend understands not only your words, but the tone of your speech, too. So your dog certainly appreciates all your long-love monologues. Ooh, you're such a good boy. Yes, you are. Number 7. Cuddling with you There's nothing like cuddling with your dog. Scientists from Azaba University, along with other specialists, confirm that your dog enjoys the experience just as much. For them, hugs are a great stress reliever. In addition, petting and talking to your pet, even for a few minutes, boosts oxytocin levels for both you and your dog. But if your dog isn't that keen on cuddles, it may be because of the history and genetics of their breed. After all, some dogs were bred to be affectionate, while others were taught to be completely different. Number 8. Leaning on you As you already know, dogs are pack animals by nature, which makes them seek closeness with their pack, and you are naturally one of them. Specialists believe that dogs lean and touch their owners for physical and emotional support, seeing them as someone who can protect and comfort them. The study that was published in Science stated that dogs experience a release of positive brain chemicals when they're with the humans they love. And some vets are sure that they often try to tighten this bond through touch. So leaning on you is a sign of the highest form of trust. Number 9. Letting you touch their head Dog training experts, including Sarah Bartlett from Hound Helpers Limited, are sure that you should never go over a dog's head and try to pet them this way, since they naturally perceive it as a threatening gesture. So if you notice your dog is not only tolerating it, but also enjoying the process and closing its eyes in appreciation, they definitely love you back. Just remember not to do something like this when you meet a new dog for the very first time. It's better to give them a moment to feel a bit more comfortable in your presence. Number 10. Calmly watching you leave If your dog feels calm whenever you leave the house, it's a sign that your buddy trusts you and knows for sure that you'll come back. However, not all dogs are blessed with having no separation anxiety whatsoever. If your dog is extremely attached to you and gets nervous or even anxious watching you leave, take it seriously and visit a vet. Experts also suggest doing the things you usually do before leaving and then staying. Then, as your dog becomes less anxious about seeing the usual routine you do before leaving, try to go out for a short period of time slowly increasing the time you spend outside. The most important thing is never to leave your pet if you see that they're stressed and to give them a nice treat if they waited calmly for you. Number 11. Going crazy when you come back. The series of experiments conducted by specialists from the Department of Animal Environment and Health of the Swedish University of Agricultural Sciences well, those experiments prove that a warm and exciting welcome indicates that your dog is massively invested in you. When you come home, your dog's emotions start certain processes in their bodies, increasing the social hormone oxytocin and decreasing the stress hormone cortisol. So don't forget to interact with your dog both physically and verbally when you get back. This way, the high level of oxytocin will be maintained for much longer. Oh, and here's a bonus, number 12. If your dog actually says I love you out loud and in English, well, not only do you have a very special dog, but you'll probably get about a billion views on YouTube. Really? Alright, 
So how does your pet show their love? Tell us all about it in the comments section below. And don't forget to give this video a like, share it with your friends, and click subscribe. Stay with us on the Bright Side of Life. Bye.